All right, turning kick steps for followers. So in this move, we're going to be turning counterclockwise for this particular thing. So the idea is we're going to fit this somehow into our inside hand-to-hand -hand Charleston, but right now we're just going to focus on the kick step portion of it. And so after we're here, so we're going to be doing a kick step. Every time we do a kick step, we're turning 180 degrees. So we've, our first kick step is going to be with the left, where we're doing a kick step. Now we're going to do a kick step with the right, kick step, and now another kick step with the left, kick step. So every time we're turning 180 degrees. That kick, we want to be turning as we're doing the kick. So you can think of it, think of it almost as though you're coming up with a little bit of a pulse. Kick step, kick step. Okay. So again coming from over here, and then I'll show it from a different angle. We're going to be doing our kick step, kick step, kick step. We want to keep going down a line, because the leader is also going to be doing that beside us. And if we don't stay on the line, then we're going to end up crashing into each other or not being able to reconnect. So just to show you going the other way now, starting over here, we're going to do a kick step, kick step, kick step. I'm pausing right now between each kick step. It would actually flow a little bit more, so it would be a little bit more like this, where we're going kick, step, kick, step, kick, step. So we're keeping that pulse and our continuous line of travel in order so that we can match up nicely at the end. Turning kick steps for followers.